use this guided meditation for sleep to help relax your mind, which in turn will relax your body. As you lie in your bed, preparing for sleep, let go of any preconceptions and expectations of what you think may be explored tonight. Instead, follow your heart. The yearnings you feel in your heart are perhaps more truthful and more powerful than any thoughts that can be muddied by overthinking or external negativity. Whatever your intention, this journey will provide some much needed peace for both your mind and body. The only thing I'd like you to do is to take one deep breath to signify that you are accepting of this journey that you are about to take. Breathing in through your nose, deep down into your lungs and expanding your tummy. Hold that breath for a few seconds and then release it even slower out through your mouth. Shifting about a little to find the perfect resting position, allow your body to start loosening and becoming heavy as your mind takes this break. It's completely up to you if you want to close your eyes. The choice is yours to make as your journey is about to begin. In your mind, in your imagination, imagine that the sun is shining on your body, warming your skin and radiating deep down into your muscles. Starting at the top of your head, that warm sensation starts to alleviate the muscles in your face. The warmth brings an expression of peace to your face. Your brow and eyes soften, allowing your eyes to feel at ease with a sensation of being softer and smoother. The idea that it's okay for things to slow down is now being realized. Your muscles around your nose and cheeks slowly descend, extending with relaxation as the warmth soothes them. As the momentum of each breathing cycle becomes less urgent, and you grow accustomed to settling down, your top lip, mouth and jaw slowly loosen from the warm energy that washes downwards. Any thought process is seen as secondary now to the relaxation that you are starting to feel in this moment. With your mind sailing away through any thoughts, it becomes clearer, giving your head a feeling of heaviness as it slowly lowers into your plush pillow. There is no need to think about anything else, except the tranquility that you are finding right now. As the warm sensation gently slides from your jaw down to your neck, the muscles around your throat and above your shoulders expand as they let go of any unneeded energy. Warm, safe and content, each breath takes you deeper into a more calming state. As the warmth spreads to your shoulders and the tops of your arms, 
your upper back and arms release down onto the surface beneath. You are calm, present, and enjoying every moment of this slowed down version of yourself. Your breathing is now eased as the warm energy glides through your chest, your ribcage, and sides. Each breath is now easier, slower, and deeper from the relief that you sense around your upper body now. Any concerns or worries are now dissolved as the warmth infuses with your abdomen and lower back. Each thought is now of a calm place, a restful space, and is replenishing your energy in every way. Descending further into your bed, your hips, buttocks, and thighs smooth out, placing your core muscles and the center of your balance heavily into the mattress of your bed. You may now feel like you are floating as you let go more now. You can sense how relaxed you are in this moment. From each calmer breath, in each loosened muscle, and every peaceful thought. Your shins and calves rest downwards. As your feet and toes descend with gravity, they are met with warm, soft grass. Looking down, you notice that you are standing in a field of vivid green grass. You are at the edge of a forest. In front of you there are some old train tracks, which are overgrown with nature. Two rusty rails peek out from the dirt and lead into the forest. Adjusting your bearings, you find your place in this moment. Above, the sun shines brightly in a deeply blue sky, warming your skin with a very slight and subtle breeze. You are wearing comfortable clothes. It's a very summery day. Far off in the distance, the rails extend in the opposite direction, disappearing through hills. Standing close to the forest, you decide that it would be interesting to find out where the tracks lead. Stepping over one of the rails, you begin to walk into the forest, in the middle of the tracks. A light chirping of birds in the trees can be heard, with the odd flutter as they move about. It's as if they are greeting you. Entering the forest, the tall trees dapple down shadows on the ground from the sunlight above. The light breeze which moves the leaves makes the ground look magical as it brings your path to life. Light glistens on the grass and turf, lighting up the unrusted parts of the rails, creating an almost neon path for you to follow. The bright train tracks glisten at the far point at which you see them. It is ever so quiet here, and you can catch yourself thinking. Whenever a distracting thought comes into your mind, 
you are almost instantly brought back to the forest. You are in wonder at this curious journey and are intrigued to know where it leads. As you look down at the train tracks and follow their direction, you begin to wonder about their history. Perhaps steam trains rolled over this line at one point, or even carriages filled with coal. As you ponder over this, you imagine the people that rode on the trains, the drivers, the passengers. You envisage what clothing they wore. Maybe they were in the Georgian, Victorian, Edwardian or even later eras. Each period was very different. With each thought, you place yourself there, in the moment. You imagine the sounds and the sights that you would see, the atmosphere, even any smells and the touch of any fabrics used in the day. Every one of your thoughts, from each step back in time, captivates you in every way. You feel a sensation of being there, and in some moments the journey is replaced with an experience of the era that you think about. The idea of sitting on a train makes you feel very comfortable. Looking out of a train window, gazing at a scrolling landscape, gives you a sense of freedom. The sound of train tracks would be relaxing. Visualizing everything about a train journey creates a sense of peace within your mind, an escapism. As you continue following the train tracks, your mind immerses in the visions that you imagine. The scenery changes once more to one of movement. You see hills and valleys peaking and dipping, large trees, bushes and fields that stretch far across the land. The sound of the train tracks and the motion of the train plays out in your mind. You are now on a train, travelling down the tracks that you were following a moment ago. Having been transported back to the Victorian era, you look about at the interior of your private cabin. You are sat on a plush and deeply cushioned seat made of velvet lavender in colour. The springs in the seat make for a truly comfortable ride. As you stroke the material, you feel its soft texture and warmth. Blue tanned leather decorates the doors, giving your cabin a very soft look. Filigree twirls and swirls are seen on the windows and various other furnishings. Walnut wood, which is ornate and highly polished with gold leaf, bends around the walls and windows, making it look very luxurious. Pillows, cushions and footstools provide the extra comfort that you may need if you desire to drift off in this journey. Whilst being very elaborate, the cabin feels very secure with its brass fittings on the doors, the handles that curve around, and the locks 
that are solidly closed tight. You can see your luggage bags on a shelf up above, with a ledge that keeps them from moving about. Anything you may need is close to hand. Polished tables look as though they have water on top of them as they reflect a mirror image of what you see. And a large bed with convenient shelves all around it has pride of place at the other end. In this era, electric is made from a dynamo fitted to the train which powered light bulbs all throughout the carriages. In your cabin, a number of lights hang, all with cotton lampshades and an outer covering of silk and velvet to match the seating. Looking out of the window, a gothic abbey adorns the beautiful countryside, untouched by any development. The complicated and intricate design towers high into the sky with sharp points and complicated sculpted decorations. Its windows large and reflective, with many different colours made up of stained glass, a mixture of rounded and square shapes. Gravel paths lead up and around the enormous building, where you can see people congregate, possibly talking about their plans for dinner. Drivers of horses and carriages wait for the gentlemen and ladies to finish their business, patiently waiting, perched on their seats. Churches are dotted all over the landscape, many with bell towers, and the similar features of the abbey. You can see possibly four or five of them. They look a little like chess pieces on a board with the patchwork of the fields that you notice. Mansions litter the land, with many small houses bellowing their coal and log fire chimneys into the air. As the sun sets, the human activity begins to settle down. Everyone seems to be indoors, as the daytime makes way for night. Windmills turn with the subtle breeze, their sails almost looking as if they will touch the ground at any moment. As the trees cover your view, train begins to slow down a little. A sign for a station scrolls past your window, and the locomotive comes to a stop. Now at a platform, well-dressed men and women adorn the station, all ready to board this delightful journey. There is quite a contrast between the dress sense of the people that you see. Although most of the men wear a hat and a fine suit, with a neat decoration of facial hair. Top hat and tails are the flavour of this evening, each very different, being bespoke to the wearer in shape, size and material. There are also men in riding suits and flat caps, in waistcoats, cravats and dicky bow ties. The women wear long flowing and plumed dresses, some with royal pastel colours of navy, burgundy, purple and green. Some are in velvet, silk, cotton and lace, again very different to each other, 
with no similarity to each. Four-legged friends, like Spaniels, Retrievers and Great Danes, sit by their owner's sides, awaiting their next instructions. As you look around at the platform, elaborate clocks furnish the station, and conductors walk calmly, directing passengers. With the last passengers stepping aboard and also exiting the train, the whistle blows for the locomotive to move on. The train moves off from the platform, with the familiar sound of the train tracks beneath and also the vibrations that relax every part of you. Now out of the platform, trees pass and reveal fields where a farmer and his dogs herd sheep. You are mesmerized by the skill involved between the shepherd, the dogs and the sheep as they all follow one another through to the next field, like a symphony of synchronicity. The farmer wears a long coat, a waistcoat and shirt, with high boots to keep him warm and dry. His crook helps to pull him up the steep hills. As the train turns a bend, you see the farmer, the dogs, and the sheep entering a courtyard where a barn is situated. There are many types of farm machinery to sow, seed, and plough the land. Horses and carts hobble down cobbled streets in a small village where a small market begins to close. You see apples, strawberries, and pears are just some of the fruits on offer, along with vegetables ripe from the farm. Tools and second-hand items that haven't been sold are placed into carts. Hats are tipped from one fellow to the other, and smiles of chatter fill the air of this very sociable event. Now beginning to get dark, the lights of pubs and coach houses glow dimly, where the cheer of song and laughter spills out into their gardens. There are people inside and out, all enjoying themselves, with tankards and glasses in hand. A feeling of peace fills every part of you from what you have seen. The moon now shines down on the townsfolk, lighting the few hours of partying and happy times that they will have before bed. Now through a tunnel, your view is a reflection of yourself from the dull lights inside the cabin. The expression on your face is one of complete contentedness. Your eyes look soft and glimmer from the positive energy you have found in this place. As you see your eyes light up with joy, That glimmer takes you back to the forest and the train tracks that you were following earlier. The subtle ambient sounds of the forest fade back in and the moon now illuminates your way. The train tracks can be seen leading you once more. An owl hoots nearby, as if reassuring you that everything is okay. 
you do feel okay. Actually, more than okay. This is the most relaxed you have been for a while. Walking onwards, the train tracks enter a tunnel. With only the moonlight helping you to see, you walk a little slower, trying to be careful where you step as you enter the tunnel. It's a little darker in here, but ahead you see a dim light. The low and dull light shines just enough to reflect the train tracks as you continue on. Getting closer, you can see that it is in fact a train carriage. It's just as you saw it in your imagination. On reaching the carriage, you open the door and climb aboard. You are once again in familiar circumstances. The velvet coverings on the seats and the lampshades look beautiful. The polished walnut wood facades look brand new and the bed untouched. You have found the carriage that you were thinking about. It looks as if it were built yesterday. The only thing you didn't get to do on your journey was to sleep in the bed. Walking over the thick carpet, you stand by the bed. Taking off your shoes and changing into more comfortable attire, you climb into the bed. Very slowly you sink as the plush cushioned mattress lowers you down. A sigh of relief is felt as you cover yourself over with the sheets. Lying your head on the pillows, your neck loosens automatically. The lights dim to a soft ambience as your back and feet ache from the weight taken off of them. As you close your eyes, you hear nothing but the calmness in each breath. The warmth builds up under the covers now, helping your muscles to relax. That same sense of peacefulness that you felt earlier is here once again. You now take your mind back to the train journey. Through the fields, through the villages, hills and valleys. Each breath becomes longer and deeper as you lose yourself in this journey. And it's up to you where the journey takes you. Focusing more on the images that you see, you begin to fall asleep. If you feel any muscles that are possibly tense, allow the soft cotton sheets to loosen them as they become warm from your body heat. As you hear each slowing breath, allow your breathing cycle to remain natural. Each breath will start to slow down and deepen on its own, the more you relax. (laughs) 
Now if you feel you need to move to be more comfortable, you can shift your body position to something more agreeable. Things will start to settle on their own shortly. Now taking your focus to your toes, if you feel that they are curled or that there is any tension in them, imagine that tension as heat. As you observe your toes, notice a sensation of heat or warmth evaporating or dissipating through the cotton sheets. With your awareness and visualization, your toes become cooler and any tension disappears, bringing comfort to the balls of each foot. feeling as though there is a band of coolness around the top of your feet, they begin to relax. Now sense that cooler sensation drift down to the arches of your feet, observing an ultimate relief of softness, which now starts to bring each breath into a more sleepy rhythm. Your feet now becoming cooler and all tension scatters into the atmosphere. The lack of tension in your feet allows them to descend as your ankles begin to unlock. Now around each ankle you feel as though there is a cool breeze as your feet slowly sink into your bed. Tension continues to naturally be expelled as you settle more into a very peaceful state. Through your Achilles tendons, your calves and shins, you notice more how the bottoms of your legs loosen further. Each muscle now softer than before, more relaxed and slowly becoming heavier. As each breath becomes deeper and longer, your knees and the area behind your knees begin to cool down and unlock bringing your already affected areas into comfort. As that cooling effect automatically works its way through each muscle, your hamstrings and quadriceps loosen immensely as they lose the heat of any tension. breath, now slow, deep and calm, your whole body beginning to rest as it should. As your mind becomes calmer and your body more relaxed, your hips, buttocks and lower back feel the undone effect of coolness, descending further and further. Now halfway to sleep, your awareness begins to fade from being so relaxed in this moment. Calmness can be felt as your heartbeat has slowed from the settled state that you now experience. In this short time before fully falling asleep, Peace can be observed in your mind, in the comfort of your body easing. With your focus now on your spine, 
abdomen and chest. Your rib cage slightly opens up to greet every new slow breath of sleep. That cooling sensation can now be felt through your back, stomach and chest, up to your shoulders. Relaxed, calm and free of any tension, your body bathes in a bliss of relief as it descends further into your bed. As your shoulders become loose, heat being expelled out of your body can be observed in the tops of your arms, working its way down to your fingers. Each part of your arm softer, each muscle now limp as your fingers unclench into sleep. Your awareness fading more and more now as your body becomes heavier and heavier, your mind drifting off. As the last of any awareness is observed, your throat, the back of your neck and jaw let go of anything holding them back from being at peace. Perhaps your mouth opening slightly as you enter into the first stages of sleep. With each breath deepening, you begin to leave your day behind and your face starts to relax. Now at the edge of sleep, your lips, cheeks and nose become cooler. Again as if a breeze is blowing against them. Each of them softer than before. As you exhale, your eyes become heavier with relief. Each eye cool, soft, relaxed and heavy. And as your eyes now only want to stay closed, your brow cools sliding downwards and flattening any creases that may have been there. Every part of your body is now in a state of peace. Heavy, still, calm and peaceful, your body descends downwards as you drift off into a deep, deep sleep. Behind your eyelids, in your mind, you can now take yourself to wherever you can imagine. Your own place that no one can touch. As you drift off further and deeper, into a very comfortable deep sleep. Allow your imagination and perhaps your memory to show you this positive place. See it as though it is a little way off through a tunnel. Floating on through the tunnel the image of this personal and safe space becomes clearer. Now within your chosen place, you can explore it at a calm pace. This is an unhurried area. You 
can imagine whatever you want that makes you feel at peace here, including anyone that you would like to see. Calmly you wander around, sensing every detail, every sound, scent, and the atmosphere of this place. As you delve deeper, your body becomes more relaxed, and your mind becomes very content. Sleep the best night's sleep now, as your subconscious now takes over. As you sleep, your mind will remember the experience, the calmness felt, the reassurance of pleasant thoughts and sensations. Rest now, drift further into the chosen safe space of your mind, and sleep a deep, deep sleep. You are your own safe space. You are content. You are relaxed. Your body is loose. mind is free of any distractive thoughts. Every breath takes you deeper into sleep. You are as comfortable as comfortable can be. The position of your body promotes rest and rejuvenation. Every exhalation expels even more deep tension out of your body. Your body is becoming sleepier. You are present, relaxed, and as calm as calm can be. Right now you feel safe, comfortable, and reassured as you just let go.